Hello everybody and welcome back to the Gamer Dunny channel. I'm Gamer Dunny and this is American Truck Simulator. Today we're going 730 miles south. It's going to take us 42 hours to get there. We're all in some potassium, 40,699 pounds. Um, we're going to some weird word Del Rio, the Union Pacific. Um, about 51 hours to get there in. It's gonna take us 42 hours, according to that. We gotta take it to a ferry, so I think we got like 560 something miles that we have to actually drive. And there's three or 400 miles on the ferry, so. Yeah. Um. Yep. I'm pulling the Dorsey Reaper, spread axle. But it, like, this thing got a uh, got a Cummins M11 in it with a Eaton Super 13 speed. Misbehave with the train horns. All right, let's get in there, and fire up, and let's get going. Gotta pump it a couple times. Good to go. Put the windows down a little bit. Go outside and get some fuel. Somewhere along the way. Oh, she's a little heavy. Later, Pablo. Turn left. I want to attempt to drive realistically as much as possible. So. Looks like we're pretty out of way. Got a couple of them coming this way though. Go. I don't know. It's no slap sign or anything. Oof, almost took that little car out. Stupid thing. She's a screamer, that's for sure. Sounds good. Stop for nothing, just give zero fucks about it. Like I turn now, whip it over. No 
peça. Get the driver down. Who stopped near the road? Been raining for three fucking days now. Anybody got a 1020 out there looking for that 1020? Come on. 1020 is the weather. Weather report. Dude said your truck's leaking oil. A little bit of drip sawn out and he goes, well, if you had a, over a hundred thousand miles on you, you'd leak a little oil too. My God. That's what I said about it. Peace, young G. There's a heaven for dogs. Come on, we've got to find a repair shop too. Fuel and a repair shop. I get the brakes checked on this thing. Get the oil changed too while we're in there. Grease it up. Get the whole whole B service now. Stuff is a good challenge. I like good challenges. I've never been down through here before, so it's all new to me. And this part of the map, the reformer map, is done pretty damn good, I think. It's better than like coast to coast. I used coast to coast, but I only use it with 
mid mid Atlantic uh, pack and uh, mid Middle East pack, I think it's called, which adds a whole bunch of little cities and fixes the big cities and adds roads, you know, back roads and all that shit. Yeah. I'll show you what I'm talking about. Mm. Go up here, see all these little roads and shit. This is those expansion packs. That's all those cities and everything. We got a lot to explore. We're down here in Mexico right at the moment, though. Oh shit, we got a squirrely road up ahead of us, don't we? No, we don't. Alright, here's a fuel stop. Bam. There's a fuel stop there. Where's the repair shop? Alright, here's a repair shop at the Tesla. We've got plenty of time. We got like fifty something hours. Forty nine. Come on, baby. Yeah, now she's talking. Better rallies. Oh, you got some on top, okay. Make sure you had three DOT lights. You gotta have those three either on top or the bottom. One or the other. Good time. We're just gonna do it this way. Six a gallon. Robbing you. Eight hundred and fifty damn dollars.
getting somewhere. Oh shit, the repair shop. I think it's on up here. How the hell did we end up with 600 and something miles? It was only three. Starting out, it was only five. We took the wrong road somewhere, didn't we? Didn't we? No, we didn't either. Run the wrong way. I don't know, the GPS is screwed. now started on this trip so it's just gonna get weird or worse the longer it goes the weirder it gets that's just the way it goes with me I do not up here with me I want to hear those pipes Oof. Repair shop. Turn around when possible. How the hell you get in there? All right, there's the X. I can see it. In. I think I'm doing, Mitch. Shut up. Had to get out and look. Had to go. Keep right. I think we just wiped out some bushes with the trailer, but it'd be all right. Thing is, once we get this bitch in there, we can't get it back out. I don't know, that's pretty fucking tight. clear. What the hell is that extra? 
Very good. Alright, let's repair the bitch. Tires are worn. Wheels are worn. Transmission engine. I'm gonna do one thing here real fast. Here we go inside. Go inside, thank you. Dangler. Oh my god, I have a dangler. Where's it at? To the pictures. Okay. Huh? Huh? Nope. This one. Yep. That's one. Um, that's my little doggy. My little buddy. Passed away what a couple months or a couple days ago. Rest in peace, young D. It would just be easier just to back it out, maybe. But I don't know there's a spot to turn this thing around at. That gate's closed, we can't turn around there. I wonder if we can, uh... Trailers gonna clear that building or not, but I'm gonna try. Yeah, it cleared it. <laughs> All right, now should you build going around and get out through the entrance for the test of the dealership? I really wish it stopped raining. Did it stop raining? I did. Hallelujah. Keep right. I'll probably start raining again, won't it? After 100 yards, turn left. Pictures all turned around. What the fuck's up with that? Where you got us going, GPS? Back out on the main road is what we got to do. What's the circle with the arrow mean? Only we can only oh, that's like one way traffic, huh? I got you. Put it down first, that'd probably help a little. Looks clear. Not too bad at all. Ass hurts. New cushion. I'll get me a big truck seat and put it in there. Hey, right. A little pressure hooked up to it. That's pretty cool. On the motion platform. Oh, hell yeah. You'd be sad, buddy. You'd be trucking. Trucking and fucking trucking and assholes and elbows. Any fuel? No, we already got fuel. The oh, M11 sounds pretty damn good. For 535 horsepower. She can hold her own, that's for sure. 
That was a good transmission match with this engine. They work good together. The Eaton Super 13. I think that's a 3.38 gear ratio on it. I can't ship with the shit right now. Yeah. Well, we're supposed to be driving realistically, huh? My bad, I just, I guess I screwed that one up, didn't I? Son of a bitch, totally forgot. Which one of these looks better? One, two, or number three? I think number three is pretty damn good. I don't know, I like one, two, though. One's got more vivid, more color pop. But this one, the bushes and trees and shit look better though. SCS told you you could add one thing to the game, it could be anything. What would you add to it? Leave a comment down below and let me know. Me? I'd have to think about it. Way too much for RPM room. Really. The ability to get out and walk around your truck could be pretty good. Kind of like what you can do in the showroom. I mean, you used the O camera, but the O camera's all fucking, I don't know. It doesn't have smooth turning on it. We can't get it turned smoothly. It's all jerky, jerk, 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 jerk. Nobody wants to see that shit. No one sees me jerking, then go to the club back the closet. Shit, huh? We're getting it, buddy. Grab the gear and we're gone. We got time for that bullshit. Ten mile an hour, my ass. Put the vision pack on. It gets that roll stability. So it's supposed to, to slow the track down when you start leaning so much to keep it from rolling over. I haven't rolled over yet in it, so... Navajo, come on, buddy.
What if I scan that barcode thing on the back of the trailer? I'll get up very close and I can try it and see. Maybe. We got her nailed too. Come on. Come on, Miss Behave. You can do it, girl. There we go. Scan that bitch. Did you scan it? Reverse the video and try it again. chance it's about as good as you come get I'm coming I'm coming hold your horses Jose how's it going boss man we good to go I guess so Hola, senor, Rita. I got just called him a lady. I'm not too sure what I said. Vendeco. Basamacula. Huto. Huton Geleste. Well, that's Cherokee. That's Indian. Oh, I know a little bit of in Cherokee. I know a little bit of Spanish. I know a little bit of uh, Irish. Finish. Have you eaten? Previous. Bump. Put on the last day. You little white pussy. Quibble. Oh, that's a drink. Isn't it? Yeah, I believe it is. Uh, four, 497 more miles. I think we should be close to the port. <laughs> Spin on his ass. Like that shit, bitch. Oh, yeah. What do you think, Allison? Crazy, huh? Man, it might be a little crazy. Got a screw loose or two. Watch it, Swifty. Sweep in the parking lot, that's a hell of a job. I had to do that at Sonic all the time. I worked there when I was younger. Go out there, sweep the pipe, sweep the light and power wash it. I do that like once a month. I had to do that shit. I take everything out of the freezer, clean it real good, put, put everything back in. It's a pain in the ass. 
but it had to be done. So we done it. I worked there since I was uh, 15, 16. When I turned 16, I started working there. And I worked all the way up until I was 18, 19. Somewhere right around there. Might even be 20. Yeah, somewhere down to there. To the firewood business, chopping firewood for people, cutting trees down and shit, and logging. Done that until I turned 21. I turned 21 and I went down and got my CDL and started driving. Here we are. 2007. I believe it was. I started up my first YouTube channel, 1312 Studios, and it's still going. Well, it's dead. I don't know if we upload videos anymore, but but it's still there for people to watch the videos. YouTube screwed me over, and I can't put ads until I rebuild. I gotta go through every video and add commentary to it. There's like 600 and something videos. I'd have to download the video, add it, and re-upload it. And it's, I didn't, my internet can't do that. It's, it'd take forever. So, it's dead. But you can't make good money. I was making good money. Bought me a $5,000 computer. Great monitor and shit, so. Had enough for food and smokes and nicotine and drinks and everything. I'd upload about three videos a week or something like that. Let's see, we don't have to go through the scale house, so we can just get straight to the ferry. If you use the icon mods, the fairy one's hard to find because it's kind of under the ground a little bit. But it's right there on the ramp. Right in this area somewhere. Might even be up here.
through here somewhere. Got me. Chose it right up here. You got me, I don't know where it's at. I don't know what to do. We're fucked. Guess that's the end of this load. Okay, so I fixed it to where we had the icon. So. Fixed it to where we have the icons now. We need to go all the fuck way down there. Six grand? I mean, they won't be able to make 50 grand off of it. I have to rip the fuck off. Life of owner operator, I guess. I need this money so we can fix up old rusty trucks. I got a Peterbilt cab over and old Mac R. Lights on. We're good to go. Recording, microphone's working. 
Ain't got shit on the screen covering shit up. We're good. Truck's loud as hell. Turn left. That's the way we like it. That's just where we turn. I don't know if I like these road textures. I think right. I like the other ones better. Go straight. I'm going to turn right. I'm going to do it the right way. Go through the damn gas station, it's illegal. That's the way you do it, GPS, SPG, whatever the fuck you are. Go straight. Go straight, turn right, turn left, run the red light. You like to tell people what to do, don't you? 210 miles. It's confusing as hell. One that goes up, one goes down, one goes left, one goes right, one turns around. Reflectors are kind of trippy. I like it. That's pretty cool. Back her down, boys. Back her down. What am I supposed to get over there? Can you just magically teleport? Well, you can, but not legitly. Here goes a front bumper.
sun will be coming up here soon. Those trees look legit, don't they? That's pretty fucking cool. Huh? Realistic. shit to see but they're right at us don't talk much do you mcdonald's ba -da -ba -ba -ba, i'm shitting it Upload the cartoon I made a while back about McDonald's. Do 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 do. I'm shitting it. Pepsi's hauling ass. Get it, boy. Don't get scared now. You stupid fucker. Why would you stop in the middle of the damn road for? Yeah, drive off, you stupid bitch. Oh, 
I was on the brakes hard as I could. Damage anything, so we're good. Wouldn't been as bad as he would have hit the brakes as I tapped him. Good. I like the way that looks. Uh, not supporting my ass. We're going the right way, right? I'm going to put a little reshade on and see if it works. It looks better. I don't want to crash here. Better without any reshade. That doesn't look too bad. That looks pretty damn good, doesn't it? Poor little buddy. She's just laying on top of the couch. She used to lay right there on the window like that when she was a puppy. Put one leg through the handle, lay up there, other leg over the side. She'd lay there while we're driving in the road. Poor little thing. I got hurt two months after I started driving the truck. Went one month out for a trainer, a month solo, and then I got hurt. We've been by, she's been by my side ever since then. Every day, every minute. If I went somewhere, she went. My little buddy. Her name was Sissy. I called her Sissy Dog. Sissy the Dog.
poor little heart gave out on her. It just couldn't beat anymore. But she had like a heart attack or something like that. And she couldn't stand up. We used to stand up and tried to walk. She'd fall over. And pooping and peeing all over the place. She'd have to go to the bathroom. What she'd do is she had to go to the bathroom. She'd get up and she'd start trying to walk to the door and she'd fall over and then it just came out. So. put down so she didn't suffer anymore. there boys god damn it just like in real life they do some shit like that No right turn, so we need to go straight. We turn left. We're going straight, I guess. Keep right, 50 yards, turn right. Turn what right. The? That's left, not right. Right? Yeah. It's all fucking true. We're gonna turn right here. and the game crashes, doesn't it? Nope. Turn right. You have reached your destination. Well, holy shit. $6,452 for 24 hours worth of work. Go 25 hours straight. Well, no, we had to vary, so I guess that'd be our sleeper at the first time. So really, we only drove 15. Something like that. We did stop and get repaired the truck. So 14, 13, I don't know. 
Anyway, thank you for watching the video. It sure does mean a lot to me. And don't forget to. Don't forget to like. Subscribe. Share. And leave a comment down below. We'll see you in the next video. Have a great day.